Good morning, sleepyhead. Hello. <laughs> Can you say that a little louder? Not really. Why? I don't barely have a voice. Every I know. I... <coughs> oh, jeez. Okay. Every time I go to talk with my voice, it makes me want to cough. <laughs> so, adding on to what Mariah just said, we have been sick, like very sick. I've had a hundred and almost three degree fever. Now listen, I started getting sick on Tuesday. We're currently filming this on Monday and I know y'all are seeing this. We're seeing it on Monday. Today. Yeah. So we're filming this today, y'all. This is, this is the morning of Monday. And I've almost been sick for a full week. Now my sickness has like gone downhill in a good way where it's getting better and better and better. I'm just still a little nasally. Mariah has been like getting the worst now. Luckily my worst of it was on like Tuesday, Wednesday of last week. Yeah, and then like a little Thursday. Right I've been like right before 4th of July. Like I got sick Friday, and then my worst I felt like was Saturday, Sunday, and I think I would start getting better, but no, I've gotten worse. I think you've gotten worse because you're, you have, like I didn't really have a cough as much. I had a cough, but like Mariah has it worse. Last night was a long night. Like we couldn't, like. I couldn't sleep. She couldn't sleep, and I stayed up with I her even, for like an hour. I even took NyQuil. And Flonase, because my nose was so stuffed up I couldn't breathe. I was literally trying to sit upright, and I literally could not fall asleep. Yeah. Like, it was horrible. I don't know what's been going around, but this is exactly how we've been for a full week, and we've both been battling in it. And do I know what's funny? We've had, like, four friends around us during the 4th of July, or even more people, but, like, we're the only ones that are sick. Yeah, I know. We're the only ones that are sick. And, sorry, our cats are aggressively fighting right now. This is the only thing that's been keeping us entertained throughout this past week. Jesus. <laughs> okay, bro. <laughs> but I will say, I am so, I had one of the best 4th of July's in a really long time. I was perfect, I was in the sun, oh that's why. I'm also very choppy on my face. I had, I think I had a little bit of sun poisoning. So yeah, Mariah has like, a, like sunburn a little bit, but it's all like, you could see her skin is like all chapped up on her face because she yeah, sat outside. Like, How many hours you sat outside? From like one to five. Bro, it was literally like a, uh, it was 11, it was, it was 11 on the heat index. Yeah. Yeah, so that's how you well, know, like that I is. I messed up, but I forgot to put sunscreen on my face. I don't know what, I don't know, because I'm very good with my skin. I'm honestly very shocked I did that. I don't know why you did that either. I really don't know why you were out there that but long. This I, is like the day before she started getting sick. Wait, did you start getting sick on Friday? Yeah, yeah, so Thursday was uh, no, 4th of July. This is the day. Bill got sick before the 4th of July, and I was like, please, please, <clears> please, <throat> God, don't let me, get, let me get sick after because I want to have the best 4th. And we were out till like midnight. It was one of the best nights. And then Friday comes along, and I start feeling weird. And everyone's like, oh, it's probably just because you were in the sun all day. I'm like, no, I feel weird. And then I got really sick. And I hit her. Then she had a. Like within one night, she went from like being like, okay, in the morning to like at night, she was just like body chills, in the bed, like couldn't do anything, couldn't move, just wanted to watch her show and go to sleep. That was it. Yeah. Now I'm just like very congested. Last night I did have a little bit of the chills again. I don't know. This but that's what happened to me. Literally, I had my chills, I had my fever, and then it went away for only the 4th of July, and then the 4th of July night, it came back and I had 101.7 degree fever again. One of our buddies we were talking to saying like the sickness going around, like his friend was the same way, like his friend was super sick, then he got better, and then it came back for like a night or two. Yeah, it came back at a night or two, so I don't know what kind of sickness this is. I don't even know if it's COVID or not. It honestly could be. And it sucks because we're supposed to go to Texas on Thursday. Yeah. And I think we might have to cancel. I'm really yeah, sad. I'm so annoyed because we've been planning this trip for so long to go visit our friends. And of course, this is the one week that we got sick. Like, I'm glad that we were okay on 4th of July because like, that's when we had people coming down and we had a party that was at our house. Like, we literally like were the hosts of our mini party that we were having. So like, we really didn't want to be sick for that. So I'm glad that like the sick gods let us not be sick for that one day. But oh my gosh, after that, like all hell is breaking loose. Like we're just so stuffed up. Like I said, it's been a week for me and my nose is still congested and my ears just got cleared out, but it took my ears like five days. We actually need to put some stuff in my ear. Yeah. But we just wanted to say, we're also really sorry for the lack of content on TikTok on snapchat on here on all of our platforms i feel like we've been very inactive but it's because we've been really sick 
and that's and honestly we, in, in, a, in the means of things like I know we are super active on our social medias and stuff and like honestly it's like only been a week so to us it feels like we've been so inactive because we love posting <coughs> so much that like within this past week we would have probably posted like double the amount of what we have been but at the end of the day like we wanted y'all to know when we don't feel good there's a lot going behind the scenes and you already know like it's like going to school it's like doing work it's like going to you know a baseball game you can't focus when you're sick like very sick so i'm glad that i'm good enough to get down here and film because like if if it was just like if i was like in mariah's mode right now i, I couldn't even film i honestly couldn't like if i was like how i was a couple days ago i couldn't even hold like my phone in my hand like the light from my phone just made me like oh i had such a bad well, headache because too. last night i felt so weird because i had night cold in me and it, it was trying to get my body to go to bed but like my body could not go to bed no i know and i i'm not gonna take night cold again tonight because that was like horrible no i know it's terrible. So you can just tell by <laughs> Mariah doesn't look like she's feeling that good. No, you look cute though. My ears are clogged. Good luck for anyone that is sick right now because like it's if you have summer. if you have what we have like and I know a lot of people do, it sucks and it lasts days. It's not like one of them like overnight or two day sicknesses. This is like a solid week. You got to give your body a solid week to go through the motions before it gets better. I don't know what it is, but I, I do not wish this upon my worst enemy. Why I is your finger in your mouth? Getting really runny <laughs> and I need to blow it. Yeah. Yeah. I know, and you're phlegmy too. This is like a nasally like sickness too, like mucus sickness. This is like, like we had a fever. You had a fever too. Yeah, we were sick. Before Hawaii, when we were you we were supposed to propose in December, mm -hmm. I don't remember getting nasally like this. Do you? No, I was this sick, but only for like three days. Yeah, it's been six days now, and I'm still like nasally like and mucusy. But I feel good. My head feels good. I don't have a fever anymore. I just feel like my nasal passages are all messed up and everything. So, yeah, that's about it. Sorry. <laughs> I'm also really distracted. But don't think that we are not trying to push out content or not trying to show y'all behind the scenes and stuff. I know stuff. you guys will understand because you guys yeah. are very supportive and I'm very thankful. Yeah, I hate that we missed our YouTube uh, upload on Friday. Friday. But we are going to be uploading that video this Friday. We are getting back into the swing of things. It's just, it probably is going to take another day or two for Mariah to fully get back into the way that Mariah is normal is normally yeah we're gonna be active on our snapchat as much as we can i literally start to come out really good it better i told you you have to like when you cough you have to like spit like it's nasty but you spit like your phlegm up you gotta blow your nose you gotta you gotta get all the crap out of your body since i was little my dad always tried to use the mucus out i never was able to why it's just gross to you no i can't do it you couldn't physically do it no yeah it might sound like i have but i can't <laughs> She's so cute. Look at her over here. <laughs> also, there's one more thing that I want to talk to you about and all y'all right now watching. If you've watched our recent TikTok and y'all know about like the video with me like picking up Meg and stuff, y'all need to understand that th that is all just a joke. Like I don't like Megan. Megan doesn't like me. Megan has a full-blown boyfriend and I have a full-blown wife and it's nothing more and nothing less. It's a joke. Like we were all hanging out. I really told them to do that. And then I'm like, Meg, let me pick you up. And then Mariah's like, wait, let me film it for a TikTok because it'll be funny. So then Mariah filmed it like for a TikTok. If y'all know us for real, like it's just a joke. I don't like Meg. Like I just wanted to get that out of there because so many people in the comments were like, you're gonna get a divorce. Divorce him, divorce oh God, him, divorce him. I know, and I'm like, bro, divorce, divorce me because I, First of all, even if I had a funny relationship with Megan like that, which we kind of do, but it's not like that, like, why is that even something to be, like, mad about? Wouldn't you be happy that I'm close? And, like, for everyone that's saying, oh, my husband was like that with my sister and, and now he's dating her and stuff, well, okay, that's just because that dude's weird. That's just because that dude, he shouldn't have ever been dating you in the first place, if you liked it. You know what I mean? Like, it has nothing to do with me yeah, liking Meg. Yeah, we never dated. Yeah, and we never dated, and it's just a joke, and we've been running with this joke for a while, and we've made some funny videos about it, but all y'all in the comments, I'm not, not pointing fingers personally, but I know maybe some of you watching this, or like, if you go see those comments, you're gonna be like, oh my gosh, can any of y'all just go in the comments and defend me? 
can any of y'all go in there and be like, yo, I hope y'all realize this is a joke or, you know, they just have a good relationship. Like this is a joke. Mariah's like, she was just filming this as a joke and stuff. So it's really not that deep, but I just wanted to come on here and also say that before I close out this video, because we're probably gonna have to make a TikTok now saying it's a joke, y'all. It's just a prank. You should do that today. You what? You should do that right now. Since you're on the, the midst of it right now. Actually, oh my you gosh. Go behind the scenes. Oh my gosh. Why? Because you're gonna re re you're gonna react to one of the comments right here, right now. Oh, I should react to one of the comments. Yeah, you should. Okay, pull up a comment that says like you guys are gonna get a divorce or whatever, like something like something like mean and weird. You know what I mean? Okay. That people are saying. Yeah, I'm gonna react to it on TikTok. Uh, do I? I don't, I don't have to do it on camera, but I'm definitely gonna react to it on TikTok right yeah, now. I have it. All right. Well, enough with that rant. I just wanted to come on here and say that because there was a thousand okay. mean comments about how we need to break up and stuff. And I'm like, bro, y'all, it's a joke. It's it's literally a joke. It, it means nothing. And hopefully we're feeling better because I really want to go to Texas <clears throat> on Thursday. Yeah, and hopefully we feel better in the next day or two. And we get over the sickness, y'all. I hate being sick. I literally hate it. Don't you? Yeah. 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 <laughs> at the beach right now. I know all of our friends are at the beach. Meg's at the beach right now. We, we can't go because like obviously, you know, we need a day to chill. But but thank y'all so much for watching this video. We freaking love y'all. We love your support. Stay tuned for Friday's video. It's gonna be a banger. We love you guys. We love you and we will see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. But until then, peace. peace. Love, love you guys. guys.